Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. This is Mathematics, and in this lesson, we want to look at the first two questions from the 2025 GCE examination. The first question says simplify two in brackets we have y minus three minus three here we have two minus y two max was given to this beautiful question i want you to watch the video up to the end so that you understand everything that i'm going to say and there are also announcements at the end of the presentation we are told to simplify like i always say identify the topic from which the question is coming from that is very important when they say simplify this expression we're talking about algebra and the stem of the question here is simplify meaning shorten the number of terms make it simple you are not solving here now you have to look at the given expression so that you are guided where you are supposed to start from in this case in the expression we have brackets then we are saying start from there start from removing these brackets that is our starting point so we're going to remove the brackets how you're going to say to get rid of these brackets there is a number outside it means i'm supposed to multiply these two by everything inside so it will be two multiplied by y i'll get two y minus the same two multiplied by three it will give me six i'm done this level this stage no brackets on the other side there's minus do the same three times two six in paper one we don't allow calculators remember that so as you're doing the calculations here, be accurate. Then this negative or minus times minus, it will change to positive. So minus times minus is positive. Then three times y, three y. I see that. Brackets are gone. What next? collection of like terms those with y must be paired so we have two y another pair is here plus three y plus three y no change of sign here why this is not an equation it is an expression so plus y remains plus y then we have these two minus six minus six like terms algebra says like terms can be added or subtracted so these we are adding they are like terms why why so two plus three will give us five why then same signs here negative negative it means you're supposed to add six plus six gives you 12 and the sign involved is minus so minus 12 what do you do at this stage this is the final stage this is the final answer why these are not like terms there is no y here so they are not like terms it means you cannot subtract that is what we are expecting the 2025 GCE candidates to give us the two marks who we'll give you for the correct answer here answer mark we'll give you a one we'll also look at the method 
Method man. Come on. We're done. Let's look at the second question. Evaluate. Here now, it's different from this. Here we are simplifying. We have shortened the number of terms, meaning two terms. But here we want to find the exact value of this without the calculator. That is evaluate. So we have fourth root, that is a four, of 16 over 81 to the power 3, 2 max. Again, this is simple. Let's identify the topic. Is this algebra? No, this is index notation or indices. We have to remember some concepts here. We are saying we have to find the fourth root of this fraction here, then to the power 3. Okay, that is fine. We are going to apply some concepts here. When you have a fraction inside, it means you can separate by doing it like this. We have 16, we have a 4, over, we have 81, and a 4. So, what we have inside here can be written like this. When you have a fraction, you can separate them like this. But remember, there is power 3 outside. Go to this, power 3. Then, what is the meaning of this? Fourth root of 16. We are saying you have to look for a number that you can multiply itself four times and it should give you 16. What number is that? The answer is 2. Fourth root of 16 is 2. Why? When you say 2 times 2 times 2 times 2, 4 times, that is the meaning here. If there is a 3 here, then they are saying cube root. If there is no number here, if we just write like this, consider that there is a 2 here, but a 2 we don't write here, that is square root. I see that. So any number can be there. Could be 60, the understanding there is that it. Find a number that you can multiply itself six times and should, should give you whatever you are given inside. So in this case, fourth root, we are saying find a number you can multiply itself four times and it should give you 16. And that number is 2. Because 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 is 16. This will give you 4, this will give you 4, and it will give you 16. Over. You do the same here. Look for a number. Find a number you can multiply itself four times and it should give you 81. That number is a 3. Remember, outside, there is a 3 there. I see this. So, at this stage, what are we going to do next? Like we did here, we separated. Even here, we are going to separate because we have a fraction inside. So we have 2 to the power 3 over 3 to the power 3, like that. Then we are going to say 2 to the power 3. What is the correct answer? 2 should come 3 times, not 2 times 3, please. Here we are saying 2 times 2 times 2. And this will give us 8 over 3 to the power 3 is 27. Are we together? At this stage, you have reached. That is to evaluate. Meaning, this is the correct answer. Your answer mark here, we can give you 1. We look at the method, we give you 1. That is that space you see is for you to show the work. ECZ is clear. Omission of essential working will result in loss of math. Are you seeing that? Will result in loss of math. So if you are not giving us this, definitely 
those are some of the sevens, eight and nine that you see students or candidates getting. So follow instructions. Whenever I give you instructions, do exactly what I'm telling you. Go and do that in your exams. You will find that things will be very easier for you. Well, these were the first two questions from the 2025 GCE Paper 1. Now, I must mention to you, ladies and gentlemen, that lessons have started. Okay? Lessons have started for those rewriting the exam. Even those in internal examination. You are welcome. The subjects that are available we have English language, okay? We have mathematics, we have biology, we have science. We also have ADIMA for those taking additional mathematics. So at senior level, these are the subjects that are available at affordable, affordable prices. You can text, whatsapp, or call. You can call me on 0 7 7 7 3 7 4 4 8 then 4 4 0 or oh, Zero nine six nine thirty eight eighty four ninety three. So zero zero seven 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 four four eight four four zero. You give me a call, a text, WhatsApp. I will be able to give you details. We have started. Lessons have started. These are reliable lessons where you'll be able to receive well detailed videos detailed de uh, vid uh, videos exercise pamphlets notes and the test i say that so it's just like normal physical lessons in class you will not be able to miss anything everything is given so I'll be teaching you. I will also be able to guide you where you can register your exam. And you pass. As simple as that. Okay? So please contact me. You start as early as possible. Preparation is waiting for you. If you have got any question, you can inbox. You can ask me. And I'll be able to attend to you. Is that clear? Don't forget to share the video, like, subscribe to my YouTube channel, my TikTok account, Introductory Learning, or Evans Kalunga. This has been your teacher. Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.